What's up everybody? I don't get to film these all the time, but today we're going to be taking a walkthrough of this 2023 IBEX camper. It is for sale. It's going to be a great deal for somebody out there looking for one. It's been barely used. I mean, I don't, when you get inside of it here in a few minutes and look at it, it don't look like it's been hardly used at all. With that being said, it's be a great deal for somebody. It's practically like brand new. And I'll tell you, it's cool. So we're gonna walk around and take a look at it and see what it's all about. I mean, look at this camper. I mean, this would be fun to take the family out on the road in, or maybe just you and your girlfriend or however you, however you got it set up in life. But uh, you'll notice the side right there just pops out. It's not the biggest camper, but again, I think you'd be able to fit you and yourself or, you know, maybe two, three, four, five, six people in this and, uh, you know, have a good time. Whatever you want to do, you can do. I mean, look at this thing. The trailer's in good shape. It's got the jacks on the bottom. Again, I'm no expert on these campers, but this thing looks fancy. Look at it, got the rims and tires right there look good. Got those Goodyear Wranglers on there, got some tread. I mean, those the tires look brand, brand new, basically. Now, from what I've been told, this camper here is basically, most of it is run off of solar energy. Up on top of the roof there, it's got solar panels and everything on it runs off of solar power except for the air conditioning. So the AC is the only thing you're going to want to plug into to have some cold air. But other than that, just cut the lights on the TV, cooking, whatever the case may be. You're going to run off your solar power. It does have right up top there, you notice, has probably one of those canopies that pops out. So if you, you know, you pull up at the campsite, I mean, once you're set up, folks, you're going to be able to enjoy yourself. You're going to have a nice little canopy to come out and you can sit out here with the chairs, you know, and do all that kind of good stuff. Um, the back, let's just have a quick look. Got a ladder back there so you can climb up onto the back. It's got a fifth wheel right here, which is kind of nice. But yeah, let me back up a little bit. I about walked into a banana spider web. Don't want a banana spider jumping on you. That's not too fun. But anyways, let's go ahead and walk in and take a look at her. This thing is super fancy. I tell you, I'd like to have one for myself. Oh, door's already unlocked. How about that? Somebody unlocked it for us. The door's a little squeaky. Probably could use a little WD-40 on the, on the side there. But you also have a screened-in door, you'll notice, right here, which is nice. Got these steps. Got a little handle. And uh, now we're kind of entering in. And look here, to the right, that is a good-sized bed right there on the right. Look at that. That's big enough for two people easily. I'd say that looks like a queen-size bed to me. And it looks very comfortable in here. You got all these windows and you got the, the blinds you can put down if you want to with the screens. You got a TV right here to enjoy watching some television or a movie at night while sitting right there. Got the creek off in the background with the water flowing. I mean, this is nice. Um, you got little storage compartments to store your clothes, towels, blankets, whatever you want to put up there. And then over here, looks like a couch, which I guarantee you, that can turn into a bed if you need it to. So that's nice. I mean, look how new everything looks. I mean, this is fancy. Got more storage under here, more power outlets, more storage up there. Here's your kitchen. Wow. Got your sink. You can cover that up if you need to. Got your stove. I mean, you can look at it and tell this has not been used at all. And it's brand spanking new. We can go ahead and cut the lights on. You got LEDs up there. That's fancy. Wow. That is cool. Let's see if we can cut some lights on in here. I don't know. We might be able to, though. So you got a porch light. Interior. Whoa. There we go. Interior lights are on. Awning extender. Side room in and out. Awning LED on. Porch light. That's cool. Anyways. So these are all ran off of the... Um, solar power and i'm about six foot tall so i mean i got plenty of headroom in here i mean this this is probably at least a six six point eight seven foot ceiling um you got smoke detectors you got a little fridge right here how about that got the freezer got the fridge down here you got a microwave more power outlets and all that good stuff Got a little bunk bed here, bunk bed there. Teddy bear bunk series. That's a lot of space too. You could cuddle up back there and watch with your iPad, get on some games, have the kids playing Roblox. 
And then right in here is the bathroom. Look at this. Got a toilet. Fan. You got the mirror. And then you got right in here. Let's see. Looks like we got, yeah, we got a little shower. Fancy. That's cool. That looks like a lot of fun, I'll tell you. I like it, man. This seems really cool. <laughs> Just a cute little sink. More power outlets. More storage. Fan on, fan off. And then you got this right here for the air conditioning unit. Water. Heated holding tank system. More lights. Right there. Not bad. You know, I mean... Oh, got more storage in here. Even got a little safe in there. A little coat hanger thing. I mean, this has got all the space you need in reality. I mean, if it's, you know, if it's me and the wife right there, we got we got a six-person family in my house. So I'm already looking at it right now. Me and, me and my lady could sleep right there. I could get my eight-year-old up top right here. I could get my daughter right there or my 12 year old and then I can get my 14 year old daughter and my 14 year old son right here so two two kids could sleep here technically because that plenty of room if they want to lay like that they could and the other two right there and me and mom right here boom I mean what more could you ask for once you get out during the day you go out camping go have some fun you got a nice little spot to cook at you could grill out and you could do whatever you want I like it let me know what you think of this Pricing on something like this is probably going to be around 25000 or so. If that's kind of affordable to you, let me know. I think it's definitely affordable. You can have a payment of around $350, $400 bucks a month. Have it knocked out in a couple years. And have a really nice new camper for many years to come with the family and go travel and have a good time. On the other side of it, it's got a logo of Bigfoot over there, which is kind of cool. All right, guys. Thanks. Let me know. If you're interested, give me a call. Reach out to me. My name's Chad. Be happy to help you get this camper today. We'll see you then.